Good afternoon all, it is Sunday and I am sitting in my conservatory which is actually becoming like the sun's like, <laughs> the sun is coming out as I'm filming this and so my face is just like gone. Now I look like I've got really dark circles under my eyes but it's really just my eye makeup, I'm going to do that and see if that's any better. Um, but yeah, I'm sitting in the conservatory which is really warm actually um, and I have had a really lazy Sunday so far. These vlogs are becoming increasingly uneventful. But anyway, um, I've had a lazy Sunday so far but I am heading into Glasgow. Why is the sun coming out like right now? Like right now as I am filming this. I don't know if this is going to work because it'll look too dark circly under my eyes. I've got a kind of smoky eye going on and I've got like um, it's an MUA dupe for MAC something. That's really good, isn't it? I can't remember any of like see in the old YouTube days and I used to watch like so many tutorials and people used Mac eyeshadows constantly and I knew the names of like all the Mac eyeshadows. Despite the fact I hardly have any Mac eyeshadows of my own, I knew the names of all of them because people talked about them constantly. Um but yeah, anyway, um I'm heading into Glasgow in the next hour or so. There's now pigeons. Can you hear the pigeons? This is going well. But yeah, I'm going into Glasgow to do my second focus group. Now, I did my first focus group yesterday in Edinburgh, but I didn't properly vlog. I kind of like, I vlogged a little bit, um, but I didn't really talk in it. And for some reason, my phone has been really, really annoying and not picking up the audio properly in a lot of occasions. Um, so I'm going to have to have that looked at, actually, because I don't know what's wrong with it. I did that at Big Weekend, which was really disappointing because I'd like filmed quite a few different clips of different bands and stuff and it just didn't really pick up the audio. So don't know what was going on there and it did it with Jill's gig last week. So I don't know what's going on there. But anyway, um, I had filmed... Uh, I'm going to turn back around a little bit now because the sun is in a better place. Um, but yeah, I filmed a tiny bit yesterday, but it wasn't really... Um, proper kind of chats I sort of panned around and showed you the girls while we were sitting just having done the focus group um, and it went really well it was a lot of fun actually it's on um, beauty blogging and social media and the sort of um, tie with that to beauty consumption so how much people are buying and how frequently they're buying and all that kind of stuff so um, that was really good it went really well um, it was a lot of fun and so I'm doing my second one today which is in glass so I can't film the focus group itself because that's part of my dissertation but um, I'll film like the girls if they want to be in it uh, and we're just going to Starbucks um, oh I sounded sort of American there I didn't like that we are going to Starbucks um, to do it because I wanted to film in like a sort of quiet cafe kind of location so that is it for the rest of the day, nothing else planned, it'll just be that and I don't know if maybe anyone wants to go for a drink after or something like that, if so I'll vlog that. Also, important thing of the day, I think my brother might be in the kitchen, I can hear footsteps. Um, but other important thing of the day, I bought this t-shirt yesterday and I can't not include this in the vlog because just, if you follow me on Instagram you'll already have seen it, but it says, you can sit with us, that's round the wrong side. But says you can sit with us. So classic Mean Girls twist on a Mean Girls reference. Um, and I love it very much. And I shouldn't have been buying stuff. But, you know, it was £8 and I had birthday money to spend. So that's how I justify it. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to go just now. But I will check back in with you later. It is now 10 to 10. And I just got home from Glasgow. And I'm so annoyed I should have vlogged, like, while I was out. But... I didn't want to vlog, I couldn't vlog during the focus group obviously because that's not allowed. By the time I finished a couple of girls had already had to head off and then um, we, Roisin and I, went to get the train really quickly because I got a text from Emma earlier saying that the trains were funny and that they were going to be like all finishing off like early and diverted and bus replacement services and stuff. Um, which was a total pain in the neck. I ended up actually, after I last vlogged, which was in my conservatory earlier on, um, when I had been all calm and prepared for my evening ahead, things just went like really badly. Things just sort of went really badly in that I had got the text from Emma saying that there was something up with the trains. So I rushed away up to the train station and everything seemed fine on the way there. Um, but in that, I left my consent forms in the house. So the consent forms I had to get my participants to sign got left here. And so when I got off the train, it was 25 to 7 and I was meeting my people at 7 o'clock and I thought, I need to print off forms. So I had to go to uni, which is like, it's only like a 10 minute walk away from the station, but 
by the time I got to uni, there was only one lab open with printing facilities and stuff happening. So I had to go there to print off these consent forms. Um, by which point it was like 5-2. During this time, I got a text from one of my friends to say that she was really sorry, but her train was cancelled so she couldn't come anymore. And I had already had a girl drop out this morning. So I was like, what next? Like everything just all collectively at the same time just decided to go wrong. So oh, I was, by the time I got there, like I was messaging Roshi and I was like, oh, everything's going wrong. Because she texted me and said like, oh, I'm already there. I've got a table, like I'll see you soon. I was like, I'm going to be late for my own focus group and everything's just gone wrong. Um, but I got there and by the world's weirdest coincidence, um, when we sat down, there was a girl in Starbucks who I know through blogging who wasn't meant to be in my focus group but was in the very Starbucks that we were in. And she's like, oh, I'm happy to help. So she fell down for my friend who couldn't make it, which was great. Um, such a bizarre coincidence um but yeah so that worked out actually really well and then yeah I had a banana yogurt frappuccino which was really good um and got some really good stuff for my dissertation so the stress all sort of evaporated and it was really good and yeah now yeah. I'm home and I am going to put my pyjamas on and have a cup of tea and watch something nice and relaxing Watched the end of 24 this week, by the way, if anyone has any interest in that or if anyone watched it. I, like, I cry at a lot of TV programmes because I'm just sort of, that I get very attached. But I don't remember crying that hard at a TV show in a really long time. It was a traumatic experience. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to leave it there for tonight and I will vlog some more tomorrow. So I'm back. I thought I was done for the day, but I thought that I would discuss this because this is something, I feel like my vlogs, I want to kind of daily vlog the way... Or not daily vlog. Maybe I'm going to daily vlog, I don't know. I'm watching so many daily vlogs just now that I think it's just making me want to get on the bandwagon and get involved. Um, but that just kind of means discussing random stuff that I'm doing in my life, doesn't it? So, yeah. So I thought that I would vlog this. This isn't very interesting, but I'm just, I'm making my tea just now and I thought I would talk to you about this. As discussed earlier, the audio on my phone is clearly not working because it didn't pick any of this up, but this is me talking about the fact that while I'm drinking a normal cup of tea just now, I am trying to drink some herbal tea. So these are the two that I have bought at the moment. This is the peppermint one um, and the green tea with lemon that are both from Asda and I have been quite enjoying them. But if you have any recommendations, please let me know. I finished up the evening by watching a couple of YouTube videos and eating a strawberry cheesecake Danish which was amazing. Thanks for watching. I'll speak to you again soon.